I'm here with the first team manager Martin Carruthers. Gandhi, what were your thoughts on today's loss and performance? Very disappointing. Um, the fairness to, to Scarborough, they're the best team we've played. You know, they were very good first half and, you know, I said at half time, you know, I was happy to come in at 1-0. We're still in the game and, and that was always the game plan. Stay in the game for as long as possible and try and nick something late on. But, you know, start the second half, you know, we said turn them in behind. You know, James Reed's turn an opportunity to put the ball down the side. They go and score it's 2-0 and we give ourselves a mountain to climb it. You know, I just said suicide, defensive suicide. And it's happened time and time again this season and, and it's just frustration because you know you're still in the game you know we, we might not dominate possession they might have been the better side but even at 1-0 away from home you know we can throw caution to the wind chase the game and, and try and nick a point but you know it's just concentration defensive lapses you know costing us dear at the minute we looked to have got a lifeline with Nat Watson's goal and it's conceded minutes later what were your thoughts on that again I've let them know you know not acceptable you know, we, we score a really good goal, we get back in the game, you have momentum. From the kickoff, Liam Bateman can edit back to Kieran Preston. We don't win the second ball. We told the defenders not to get too tight to Big Oldshaw. You know, he, he turns, that's what he wants. He turns, we can see the penalty. 3-1, it, it's suicide and it? it's not acceptable. Uh, we have to defend better and we have to manage the game better. And, you know, to say we're naive is a, an understatement. Uh, Experienced players on their side, they manage the game, they, they manage each other and uh, inexperience and naivety was just uh, crystal clear for all to see today. One of the pleasing points for you probably was Liam Herm returning. What are your thoughts on his performance and how is he going to go back into the squad? Yeah, I mean, you know, I asked him at half time, you know, how long can we get out of him and, you know, he said 25, 30 minutes and, you know, it's going to take a while to get his sharpness back but, you know, we're going to need him. You know, you just saw his old play and, and being effective using his physical presence and experience up top. So, you know, it's vital we get him back fit. We have to manage him carefully because, you know, we want to make sure he's 100% fit for the remainder of the season now. So we'll work hard with, with the physio to do that and, and get him valuable minutes and build him up. But yeah, we, we really miss him. And finally, next up, it's the League Cup. What would be your approach to that game? Uh, you know, uh, this time last year, you know, we're flying high and we're looking to rest players, you know, not on this, not on this occasion, you know, we've got a couple more injuries today, you know, where it's going to be pretty much as strong as possible and, and go there and, and get back to winning ways and uh, get the momentum going again. Cheers, Gansu. Thanks a lot. Cheers, mate.